In this video, I'll show you how you can run or how you can set up the Java program in your favorite code editor which is Visual Studio Code under just 5 minutes. Let's get started. Alright, I hope you have already installed Visual Studio Code. If not, go to code.visualstudio.com and you can download your Visual Studio Code. Alright, next what you have to do is go to your favorite browser and just type Visual Studio Code for Java and the very first link you get is all related to Java documentation for Visual Studio Code and here you have an option to install coding pack for Java or if you just come here you see you have Java getting started tutorial and if you just click on this you'll come to this particular link and you have installed the coding pack for Java. So either install from this particular link or you can come and install from here. Alright, just click on this particular link and it will open the installer file. Just wait for some time. So I'll just click on this executable file and just wait for some time until it loads up. So almost we are there. Now just click on this next button and you see it says Visual Studio Code OK. That means Visual Studio Code is already installed and if it is not installed, it will show not installed and if you just click on this install button, it will even install Visual Studio Code as well. For now, I'll just click on this install button and you see here, it will download the JDK and since Visual Studio Code is already installed, so it is not going to reinstall Visual Studio Code and it is also going to add the required extensions which we want for running our Java program in Visual Studio Code. So just wait for some time. I'm not going to launch this Visual Studio Code. Let me just click on this finish. And from here, I'll just say VS Code. And I'll just open this particular app. Now before that, what I've done is I've just created a folder where I'll be setting my Java program. So the name of the folder is VS Code for Java. All right. So I can just copy this particular path as well. And I'll just go to my Visual Studio Code and here, First, what I'll do is I'll just open the command palette. I'll just give control shift and P and I'll just click on this Java create Java project or what you can do is you can just search here Java create Java project. Click on this particular link. Click on this no build tools and I'll just give this particular link. So this is my project location. Select this. And again, just give the name of your particular project. So I'll just give my first project. Just click enter. And now you see here, we have this particular project. And you see here under SRZ, it also gives a default sample file, which is app.java. And you see, just wait for some time since it is your first load it will automatically do some background checking and it will update your files. You see, you have some options here. At top, you have this particular option, for example, run file. You see, if I just click on this drop down, you have run Java, debug file, I mean debug Java and so on. So you see, at the background, automatically it is going to run and it is importing projects and so on. Now, let it run for some time. It will take hardly like 30 seconds to one minute depending on the speed of your internet. Now you see here, you have this run option and debug option, right? First, let me just close this. It's not required. Okay. This is some other error. Do not worry. You will not be getting this error. So just cancel it. And you see here, you have run and debug. So I'll just click on run or you can run Java from here. So at this moment, I'll just click on this run button. And you see that automatically the code is getting compiled and you're getting this output that is hello world at the bottom, right? So at this moment, let me wait and you see here, I'm getting hello world. So this particular hello world we got previously because we ran it from here. And next time I tried to run from here. So this is how you can set up your Java project. And in the same way, you can add some other files also. So if I just come here, I can just say new file and I can just give test.java, just click enter and you can add 
your classes and so on. All right. And you see here, you have a lot of hints in this particular code editor and this is brilliant. So the beauty of using Visual Studio Code for your Java program is because it is lightweight and it is very beautiful compared to other IDEs, for example, Eclipse, NetBeans, etc. So that's it in this video. In just under five minutes, I've shown you how you can set up your Java programs. So if you like the video, please hit on the like button and do subscribe to our channel. And in future, I'm going to create a course on Java, which will be approximately like 10 to 15 hours of complete tutorial, which is going to help you a lot. So if you want to watch that particular course, then do subscribe to our channel so that you'll get updated. And as soon as I publish the course, you'll get a notification. So that's it. Thanks a lot and take care. Bye bye.